We're going to put on a little bit of a demonstration here for you today in regards to our burnover drill. Burnover drill happens in a case of emergency if we are in trouble. But we try to make it as safe as possible. So we've got some a few things on, on our vehicle to show you. What's happening right now is the guys have actually gone into the drill already, they've jumped the gun a little bit. Uh, Gary in the front seat has put the sirens on to alert the crew to come back to the vehicle. Once the guys are back at the vehicle, the pump operator back, obviously they've run away from me. Um, we'll tell the rest of the crew, alright guys, let's jump in the vehicle and let's get, get into burnover. So right now what they're doing is they're actually putting all of our fire blankets down. You what you'll hear, if you can hear my radio, is they're actually starting their emergency mission. So the guys are really quick today, I think it's a bit hot, I want to get out of here. But in the cab they've rolled down all their, their blankets, so this is our heat shield, so it stops the, as, much, as much heat as possible. What I've got down here is Andrew. Andrew's actually doing what the guys are doing inside the vehicle at the moment. So right now he's putting on his his um, his in cab air system. Okay, so this is going to help him breathe in the vehicle. He's also got in front of him he's got his burnover blanket. What the guys in the vehicle have done now, I'm going to move out here and get wet. Uh, what the guys have done now, they put on our deluge system. Okay, so our deluge system is going to stop any of the flames actually attacking the vehicle as much as physically possible. All right, so in the, in the back at the moment, these guys are doing this. They're getting really, really low. They're putting all our blankets on, and this is going to help them with the fire. But what can you imagine, this is a wool blanket. 30 plus degrees in the middle of a fire, wearing all our gear plus a blanket. Andrew is starting to get really, really hot. This has to be done within 30 seconds. Once they're in the vehicle, they need to be in that position within 30 seconds and get the deluge system on. They're also sending out emergency messages as they're doing a lot of things in the vehicle at the moment. All right, Andrew, you're good? Yeah, switch off. So what the guys will do now, they'll turn the deluge system off, they'll roll up all their blankets and they'll actually look at exiting the vehicle and making sure that the vehicle is still able to be used. When I say able to be used, it just means to get off the fire ground. This appliance, once it's in burnover, is no longer usable until it's been deep safe. So the vehicle will come off, somebody else will put a different vehicle in, and they'll go to work again. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to hand over to Peter, and he's going to show you a little bit more about if you're in your personal vehicle and what kind of things you can do to help you.